The Senate had on Wednesday a plenary session called for the called for the immortalization of late High Chief Raymond Anthony Dopesi, who was the chairman of Dark Communications PLC. The call followed a point of order raised by Senator Francis Alib Kemena a do not during plenary. In his point of order raised, Senator Francis said the deceased left behind a legacy which generations now and those after him will be proud of and worthy of immortalizing by the Senate. In separate submissions, some other lawmakers condoled with the family of late High Chief Raymond Dokwesi over the great laws. The Senate thereafter had a one-minute silence for the deceased and promised to send delegations to support the family. Raymond Dokwesi is a man that, is, uh, that cut across the length and breadth of Nigeria. There's hardly a state that you will not have reason to believe that Raymond Dokwesi is from that place. My distinguished colleagues, the death of the Pussy came as a huge shock. On that day, when there was a transition from a president leaving to another president coming in, when Nigeria was expecting a new hope for a new dispensation, that is when the news of this great patriot came on that he was dead. Thank you, Mr. President. Biodo Olujimi, Kiti South. Mr. President, I rise to join my colleagues in mourning our brother and our friend, Doc High Chief Dr. Raymond Aleogod Wesi. I called him Araba when he was alive, and also the jinx breaker, because he broke the jinx when he brought the African Ocean lines. He also broke the jinx when he brought dark communications and the AIT. Dr. Dokwesi was a true Democrat. Prayer number one is observe a minute silence in his honor. All those in favor say aye. Aye. They can say nay. Prayer number two, urge the federal government to immortalize him. Those in favor of this prayer say aye. So they can say nay, the eyes have it. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.